Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to add the mp3 file to the PDF file. In this case, if you are teachers, then it's easy for you and it's easy for your student as well. Imagine you have to send a listening exercise like this to your student as homework and you have to also send another mp3. It's fine, but it's going to be better and more convenient if the student just, you know, have one file and they can click and they can do it on just one file on one screen rather than just you know playing it and open a multi window or something like that all right so if you want to know how to add the mp3 to the PDF file then let's follow along but first let me show you um, that it works okay so it works okay so now I'm going to show you from scratch so I close this uh, PDF file and I open the new one the new one that I uh, didn't do anything to it yet, so I open it and this is the, the new PDF file and you will have to go to home tab and then go all the way to audio and video this means you can add not just audio but also the video file okay but in this case I will show only the audio file how you can add it but if you want to do with video do just you know select the video file that's it okay so now I want to add the audio file so I click on it and after that you will see the crossed symbol so you have to uh, you know use with your mouse you have to hold it down and drag it if you feel satisfied with this area just release your finger and it will um, you know show the box okay which you have to click on browse and then this is TypeScript 4.1 so I click on it click on open and click on OK. If you want to add more, just do it. If you want to finish, just click on Save. But in this case, I want to add more, so I click on Audio and Video again, and then I go to this one. All right, I feel satisfied. I release my finger, and now I go to Browse, and after that, I click on TypeScript 4.2, click on Open, and click on OK. It is done. You can save it, and you can test it by you know clicking on it, play, it works and one more tape script 4.2 right so this is the right track which you can save it and it's going to be uh, surprising for a student because now you can add the audio file to the PDF file so you can do this not only with classwork but also for the listening test the student can listen to it and do it on the same PDF file now if the student have the computer they need to install um, the Foxit Reader or maybe Adobe Acrobat uh, Pro so that they can um, play it. And for the students who have the smartphone, then they have to install um, this software on the smartphone as well. So they have to go to Play Store or they have to go to, um, you know, App Store. And then they have to download the Foxit Reader. So go to Play Store. In this case, I show on the Android. But uh, it should be easy because it's a similar or the same just go to app store and type the name Foxit reader okay and then click on install because i already installed it and i already um you know um send this file to myself to, to test it and if i click on this i will see the recent files i have opened so this is the file that i just did on this if i open it then you can see this is the interface of the mobile uh, app of the Fox Reader. If you click on this, now let me tell you: on the mobile phone, it's um, it's of more features. It means it contains the fast forward, the rewind, the stop, the pause, and the play button. And also, the student can slide forward or slide backward to fast forward or to rewind, so that they can play this file to the specific time frame they want to. So if you have any questions, don't forget to leave the comments below this video. And if this video is useful, don't forget to share it with your friends or you know give it a thumb up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet, so that you can get the useful uh, videos you know uh, like this in the future when I upload new videos. So see you in the next video. Good luck and stay safe.